Hey guys, it's Jeanette, aka Sweet Jean. Um, welcome back to my channel. Uh, this is just going to be like a memory keeper type video so that I don't forget because I'm trying to try to remember to document things that are going on with me. Um, I've been noticing, I hope I don't get emotional because I just put all this makeup on. I'm getting ready for work and I got up early. But anyhow, um, I've just been noticing a lot of, um, I don't want to say headaches, but more like head pain or pressure, like at the nap or at the back of my head. And I noticed that the muscles right below my hairline or at the hairline, every so often um, they cramp up. And then I've been getting pressure like in the front part. And then I've also been getting pressure like back here. And I don't know if it's all in my head or if I'm just feeding into it, but I feel like I'm being, like I'm getting confused sometimes. Um, for example, um, yesterday I had to work and I knew I had to work. And my sister asked if I could take my niece to work at 12. And I said, sure, yes, of course. And then she text me back and she said oh I'm sorry I thought I was texting mom do you work tomorrow question mark and I said I thought about it and I said oh yeah I do I know I do <laughs> so I said yes I work tomorrow I'm sorry I don't know what I was thinking I got confused I don't know why I thought it was a day off in the middle of the week um, and then I've noticed also when people tell me a certain um, detail about something or ask me to do something I have full intention of doing it actually sometimes I don't because I just don't want to do something but I know that I've been asked and I need to do it you know just out of courtesy um, if it's something that's not crazy you know um, and then I'll forget to do it um, and then I've noticed also with certain things and certain tasks, it's taking me a lot longer to complete them. Um, and I'm going to dab my eyes really quickly. Because um, I just don't want my makeup to mess up. So, I just feel like I've been getting very forgetful. And not retaining information as good or as well and that could be with because I'm getting older and it's something that just happens with age and I'm hoping that that's what that what that is but um, I also have been wearing a lot of these headbands that are um, pretty tight and they hit me right under here so that could be the reason why I'm getting those little muscle spasms back there because I'm not used to wearing these um because my hair is growing and it's getting a little bit longer and it's in my face so i've been using those so i may trade those out to like the plastic ones that are a little bit more lightweight and they don't hit me under under my neck i mean under my nap of my you know you know what you know what i'm trying to say so it could be that that's causing those muscles to like cramp up after a while because you know it's like essentially having a rubber band around your head all day um and that that could be the reason why i'm getting that but i just wanted to document that um it has me thinking and it has me a tiny bit worried um the last time i had a brain mri was i believe last november or december um, so I'm going to see about maybe having her do another one, uh, just to clear my mind. And I, I hate asking cause I don't want to put that out into the universe and for that to like manifest. I hate that, but I have to be also proactive in my health. And so, you know, I have to be my own advocate whatever that means so anyhow I'm a little early because oh also I've just been really really spent and tired 
like after I get home from work I lay down and I just instantly want to fall asleep my muscles in my um, shoulder blades in my um, shoulders and between my shoulder blades like my spine area and to my neck are just so tender and, and sore by the end of a work a day which is only five hours but still I get up you know an hour and a half prior to that to start getting ready and um, anyhow um, I have been helping out with other tasks that I um, am still kind of learning and then there's like certain deadlines and certain things that I need to complete before I leave and so I think I'm giving myself a headache the scratching you hear in the background is my dog. She wants to come in. But anyway, so I think my body's tired because I'm tense and I'm, I'm stressing out a little bit. And even the little bit of, of tension and stress on my body, it feels like a whole lot more only because of the surgery. Any other person who's doing what I'm doing, if they didn't have the surgery in their neck... They maybe have a little bit of stress in their shoulders, but, you know, nothing more than that. But I think since I'm already um, a little bit weak in my upper back, well, a lot weak in my upper back, that whenever I'm stressed out and I have a lot of tension, when I get home, I just want to, like, lay down and relax, and then I knock out. And so I could knock out for a good three hours before I wake up. And so yesterday, got home, and uh, I talked to my boyfriend for a little bit um, on video chat. And I think we got off the phone around 6. I got home around 4-something, just after 4. And I spoke to him until just after 6 uh, p.m. And when I hung up the phone with him, I had full intention of going to eat something because I was hungry, I hadn't eaten since that morning. Um, I had gotten three tacos, but I only ate half of each of them because I didn't like, it was a new place and I didn't really care for them. The, the, the tortilla itself was like, had a, I don't know, they weren't homemade. <laughs> they weren't homemade and I didn't like them. So I ate half of one taco, I'm like, no, I threw that one back in the bag. Opened another taco, one was carne guisada, I ate half, threw that back. The other one was um, chorizo and papa. I ate half of that, like, nope, threw that back. And the third one was um, country sausage and egg. I had to take the egg out because it had, a, like, a lot of yellow in it, like, uncooked yellow parts. And I like my egg, like, uh, mixed first and then fried <laughs> so it's all yellow instead of like when you crack an egg in the pan and then you kind of mix it slowly so you have some white parts and some yellow parts <laughs> I don't like it like that it just grosses me out anyhow I ate, I took out the egg and just ate the sausage and I said this one was going to be the one that I eat because I like sausage but the tortilla just would not let me so I'm like nope threw that one back in the bag and I like I had this bag and I just threw it in the trash so when I got off the phone with my boyfriend at 6 a little after 6 I said I'm gonna go get something to eat I don't know if I want like noodles what did I tell him I was craving either noodles like Thai food noodles or tacos from Taco, from Taco Bell and so I got off the phone with him and I laid here and I fell asleep. I was actually, my body was hurting again, you know, I was stressed out. I was spent, um, but my hunger usually takes over and so I make myself get up and go eat. But lately, I rather rest than eat, which I guess isn't a bad thing, but I mean, anyways. I laid here and I fell asleep at little after 6 last night and I stayed in bed the whole night. I got up one time and that was to answer the door because my sister had got home late and um, she didn't have her key. So I heard the doorbell, I heard the dogs barking and so I got up, opened the door half as you know, still half asleep, came back to my room and laid down. So I got up a little early today, got ready for work um, and I'm ready to go get some work done. 
And since I'm a little early, I'm going to go get two tacos from where I normally go, which is Blanco's Original Cafe, carne guisada with cheese, and country sausage with cheese. <laughs> and um, some coffee. Um, but I'm, I'm happy that I slept pretty well. I didn't wake up that much. I didn't toss and turn that much. So I feel okay right now. So hopefully this gives me enough... Um, what, what, am, what am I trying to say? Hopefully, I feel good enough to do what I need to do at work before my body starts responding. <sighs> because I had pretty good sleep. So anyhow, that's pretty much it, guys. It's just me chit-chatting with myself. No, I'm just kidding. Chit-chatting with you guys. Um, thanks for tuning in. Uh, thanks for all the support. Thanks for the new subscribers. Um, if you're new watching this channel and you're not a subscriber, I really wish you'd consider subscribing. Um, I have a really awesome community here. Um, there's 500 plus of us here. It's a small channel, but you know, that's okay. I'm not on here um, with uh, a goal of gaining subscribers. I'm on here to document my life to keep um, like a memory keeper of things that are happening to me um, updates change in medication change in symptoms um, for those of you that are brand spanking you I have stage 4 uh, breast cancer which is considered terminal because there is no cure it can be treated with chemotherapy um, I've been um, diagnosed now for a little over three years and I will be starting a new chemotherapy which will be number four because once it stops working they stop that particular chemo and start you on a new one so I'm hoping and praying that I never run out of options and I'm hoping and praying that this ne next chemo that I start um, will work for me for years and years that's the goal um, so far each of the chemos has lasted under a year before it stopped working so I'm trying to find that magic one that's gonna keep keep working and not allow the cancer to uh, grow and spread and progress so anyhow thank you guys so much for tuning in again I appreciate it love every each and every one of you guys and appreciate each of you um, I will see you guys in the next video I gotta get to work bye